welcome to Textile TV. Stay with us and increase your knowledge. Five steps to minimize the fabric wastes during cutting. Reduce the yields of lilos. Some allowance is needed in the ends of each pieces of fabric during fabric spreading because of limitation of the utilized machine for fabric extensibility and fabric spreading. This allowance is usually two inches in each end and and on each fly four inches fabric washes. This washes varies with durability of the fabric. These washes can be reduced by observing and controlling carefully of how much allowance needed for various fabric. These washes may be reduced for larger marker length and increased for smaller marker length. Minimize the selvage loss. Each fabric has two selvages along its width. Selvage part is cut out. The amount of cut out is considered 3% along its width. The amount of fabric width to be used depends on the quality of selvage with flatness and alignment of selvage. The more fabric width, less will be fabric wastes. Reduce the losses of fabric ends. During the preparation of fabric lay, the last or end of the fabric roll are separated by cutting. Fabric wash is increased for this cutting. The larger fabric length in the roll, the lowest wastes of fabric and the proper contouring can reduce the wastes of fabric. Careful about fabric purses. Fabric length is identified by fabric manufacturer. So during purchase the fabric, take care about fabric length, width and quality of the fabric can reduce the wastes of fabric. Identify fabric defects. There are two defects as group shading and running shading. If group shading is present in the fabric, it must be rejected. But if running shading is present, the fabric can be used by marker only with the better side of the fabric. 